Hello everyone, this is Julie. 本日はグリム童話でリスニングのスキルアップを目指しましょう。本日のお話は、白雪とベニバラです。Once they had spent the night in the wood, and the dawn had rose them, they saw a beautiful child in a shining white dress sitting near their bed. He got up and looked quite kindly at them. But said nothing and went into the forest. And when they looked around, they found that they had been sleeping quite close to a precipice and would certainly have fallen into it in the darkness if they had gone only a few paces further. And their mother told them that it must have been the angel who watches over good children. Snow White and Rose Red kept their mother's little cottage so neat that it was a pleasure to look inside it. In the summer, Rose Red took care of the house, and every morning laid a wreath of flowers by her mother's bed before she awoke, in which was a rose from each tree. In the winter, Snow White lit the fire and hung the kettle on the hob. The kettle was of brass and shone like gold. So brightly was it polished. In the evening, when the snowflakes fell, the mother said, Go, Snow White, and bolt the door. And then they sat round the hearth, and the mother took her spectacles and read aloud out of a large book, and the two girls listened as they sat and spun. And close by them lay a lamb upon the floor, and behind them Upon a perch sat a white dove with its head hidden beneath its wings. One evening, as they were thus sitting comfortably together, someone knocked at the door, as if he wished to be let in. The mother said, Quick, Rose Red, open the door. It must be a traveler who is seeking shelter. Rose Red went and pushed back the bolt, thinking that it was a poor man. But it was not. It was a bear that stretched his bored black head within the door. Rose Red screamed and sprang back. The lamb bleated, the dove fluttered, and Snow White hid herself behind her mother's bed. But the bear began to speak and said, Do not be afraid. I will do you no harm. I am half frozen and only want to warm myself a little beside you. 